For 19 years, a coalition of activists have stood outside the White House on January 11th, calling for Guantanamo to be closed. They've done that outside the White House. They've done it in cities across America. It's even been done in countries across the world. I've been told and I believe. I've been told and I believe. Ain't no justice, same no. Code Pink went to Guantanamo. Uh, Medea Benjamin, Ann Wright, Cindy Sheehan, myself, we went outside Guantanamo with family members of those held inside calling for the closure in 2007. This has gone on far too long. It should never have happened. 40 men remain in Guantanamo until today. This is 19 years after its opening. They are all Muslim. 10 have already been cleared to leave and are still being held. We need to stand up and say, close this inhumane, torturous place. Tell Biden, this must end. There is a new film that's out this week, The Mauritanian, about Mohamedou Aslahi. This film exposes the violence of the US government to innocent men, over 900 of them, held in Guantanamo Bay. We're using the launch of this film to call yet again on those in Washington, D.C., and this time President Biden, to finally close Guantanamo, a shame on the United States of America. Please call on President Biden to close Guantanamo and join us on March 6th for a Q&A after watching The Mauritanian with Mohamedou al Sahi and Nancy Hollander, his attorney, played by Jodie Foster in the film. We hope you can join us. We hope you can act now. Thank you and onward to peace.